everyone welcome back to the channel this is substance tv and i am here to give you guys all the juicy details of what happened at the big brother ninja pool party on thursday night yes guys the night was beautiful it was amazing it was fun 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 like i really really had fun watching this housemate and there were some housemates i was just looking forward to see because haha -ha, i wanted to know what will happen i want to know what will serve i wanted to, to just know what will happen at that pool party and guys i finally saw i see saw sin <laughs> oh my god guys trust me the party was amazing everybody was having fun everybody was free dancing you know vibing real well dancing with one another guys it was really really fun watching this housemate and guys is there any party that big brother will host that there won't be a little bit of romance is there any party <laughs> oh my god like i said everybody was having so much fun 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 and there are some people that my eyes caught like i literally love the way they were dancing you know i love the way they were vibrating one another in fact say looking at them or watching them alone is just so satisfying the first that i really noticed from the beginning of the party till the very end was onyeka <laughs> onyeka was just in another world on her own enjoying herself dancing ah like i actually love the fact that you know she was just making herself happy it was so so fun watching um Onyeka and I was just laughing when I see her I would just laugh okay she's really a like she's a vibe okay she's she's full of positive energy I love her energy at the party I love the fact that she had the she had good moves I love the fact that she was dancing with the housemates okay so guys another person I saw like I saw 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 was Tofa and Damilola Woo! I was really amazed like when I saw them I was like ah ah Sofa and Damia, look at them, oh guys, hey, they're really, really dancing, like, really? You know what is happening between this, um, Tofa, Damlola, and her, and Damlola's pair, too, you'll see, the whole drama between these two girls and, you know, Tofa, but I was really excited to see that, um, Tofa and Damlola are, were dancing, like, they were really together throughout the party, okay, most of the times, I literally saw both of them together, okay, and it was amazing watching them, and trust me, I love how Dami was looking, Dami was like, looking so good and different, like, even her dance moves, like, her moves, I was like, oh my god, girl, you got the moves, okay, it was really fun watching Dami Lola dance, alright, and we also have, <laughs> Wani and Sean, in fact, say, hey, these people, like, they were literally the people I was looking out to see, like, where, where, where are those people, what is up next, what are we, what are we expecting, <laughs> oh my god, guys, eh, when the thing finally happened, hey, he said, I was like, it has happened, oh, it has happened, as if I had known that it would actually happen at the pool party, okay, when I saw how close they were, I was like, ha, these people would lock lips like they would definitely lock lips in this party and they did like it it was it was serious and my guy sean he had no they did one place he does the movie on and i'm like bro we coming down there is still time 71 days you have not even spent up to up to seven days guys it was really really <laughs> it was really really um should I say it was fun watching these people? It was actually fun watching them. It was fun. Mm? It was fun watching them, right? It was. And again, Wani and Handy, I actually liked their dance, okay? And I love the point where Wani and Handy started giving the same dance moves. I'm like, oh, shit. Guys, it was really, really fun watching these two. Okay, these were the people that were giving us the vibes, the energy, the sweetness in this pool party. Like, they just did everywhere. They danced. All of the people I mentioned there, they were just dancing, dancing, dancing. We also have Nelly. We have Nelly and... um. Um, DJ DJ Flo, yes, they, they were under people that were catching fun on their own. We also have um, Nne. Nne was dancing, guys. A lot of people were dancing. We had Tofa, we had Suj, Ben, TJ. You know, they were all catching fun. They were dancing and dancing and dancing. And I'm like, yes, this particular pool party is really happening. Uh huh. I almost forgot Chinwe and Zion. Chinwe and Zion were another people that were having a good time together. <laughs> These people were in another world of their own. They were catching fun. They were in the pool, dancing, playing, doing some touchings. And I'm like, hey, hey, these people are on their own honeymoon, guys. In fact, this one's not, this one, uh, vacation. Nobody's saying a big brother matter. 
vacation. <laughs> but actually, it was nice watching Chingwe and Zion. And we also have Kelly Ray and Cassia. They were also dancing and dancing. And at a point, I was like, ha. May these people not go, may they not go kizo, may they not go kizo before they go for and. But guys, I was really, really amazed. I was impressed that those people controlled themselves, okay? They really controlled themselves. And I'm like, ha, these couples are strong, go oh, really. They are really, really strong. And I just hope that they continue with this energy till the end. May they, may they not go lose guard. May they not lose guard, guys. Okay, so guys, there were a lot of food and drinks for these people, you know, they were eating drinking and dancing and now guess what guys guess what i miss this phone i miss this bubbling party something terrible almost happened like something really terrible almost happened and this is when tj entered the pool and was swimming okay there were a lot of people in the pool people were entering the pool coming out okay and tj entered the pool and before you knew it was all that this guy was struggling with his life like struggling almost drowned he almost drowned in the pool, oh. thank God for his um, his partner, Ben, that saw him and just grabbed him out of the pool. And I'm like, Jesus Christ, what if something had happened? Like, what if something had happened? You know, a lot of people's attention were not even on the guy. People were on their own dancing. Even the um, guy that was even inside the pool, Femi, didn't even know what was going on. The guy doesn't look him. Okay, when he was still struggling with his life, he was just looking at him. But thanks to Ben, who kind of rescued him. If not, then our story is another news entirely. God forbid. I'm like, I'm really grateful that nothing bad happened and the party was a success, okay? So, guys, after the party, everyone retired to the lounge, okay? And then I saw that Handy and Wandy were, were unhappy, okay? They were just talking angry. Like, I don't know what made them upset. Okay, they were really, really complaining, saying that this thing happened. I don't even know what we're talking about, okay? I didn't really grab the news. But, you know, finally, we got to know what really happened, okay? So, these people were literally upset with the Mbadiwe twins, okay? The head of house, especially, I think, Ozzy. Yes. Yeah. So, I don't know what Ozzy, how Ozzy spoke to them, okay? But, it was, the thing that happened was, during the party, okay, um, Ozzy had gone to use the restroom at the head of house, um, you know, head of house lunch, and... Then Big Brother called him to the diary room and spoke to him and told him that he should tell Handy and Wandy um, not to, is it not to pour the drinks on their mic or is she about the drink, okay? So, Ozzy came downstairs and went to the garden where, where they were having their party, okay, and told them that, hey, 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 no lose guard on top uh, alcohol. You know, there was how Isha said it that they probably didn't like okay they were like he shouldn't have spoken to them like that because when he said that they were not like uh-uh it was like they're like uh -uh, why would you talk to us like that i don't understand why are you to tell us how to take our drink and it was not like why are you acting childish okay so probably that's why you're acting childish got to them and you know they got angry they're like no is he supposed to talk to them like that no they are adults there's the way he spoke to them that is not making them happy at all and you know they just needed to clear him on that so while they were complaining you know sean was also there trying to get the g's then we had unika unika came around and was trying to console her okay it's okay it's okay i know that you're angry but it's okay so shall after after everything shall they shall resolved it okay they resolved it yes guys and then we have hey <laughs> we have Toby Forge and Cassia. Cassia, that is Kelly Ray's wife. Guys, I don't know if Toby was under the influence of alcohol that made him spill a lot. You know what they say about alcohol? That alcohol will bring out the truth in you. Okay, what you have been hiding, alcohol will make you say all those things. All right? So, Toby Forge said a lot. He said a lot to Cassia. And remember that initially, this guy was actually wooing Cassia. And... There again, we saw him talking to his pair, Mayo, that he's actually playing games with her. And now, he's still wooing her. Like, this guy is really, really, really crazy. Like, crazy about this girl, okay? Still wooing her. And I am very sure that this guy was actually high, okay? Because he also said that. He said, thank God he's high. At least he can say his mind without restrictions, okay? So, I think he was, I think he was high. He spilled a lot, guys. He told um, Cassia that he really likes her, like, he really loves her. He wants to get her pregnant and marry her okay he just feels like pinning her to the wall and giving her a deep kiss like a deep kiss you know he really really loves her that she's she's a complete speck okay that he loves the way she smiles the way she laughs he loves her body he just loves everything about her and guys so before it was going on and on and on and on about like bro you don't follow 
you don't force Katia. Like when we were saying all those things, Katia was just laughing. She was laughing. And really, in fact, she needed to laugh because it was actually very funny. It was funny. You need to see how he was just saying it. I myself, I was like, ha, hey, hey. Oh, God, Toby, Toby, the game player, you don't fall your hand already, you. It's so you don't ready to talk. You don't to talk. And we know that this guy actually likes this girl because I don't believe that this is a game. Nah, it can't be a game. And one thing I actually noticed when all this talking was going on was how the camera was also going towards her husband, that's Kelly Ray. Once we see um, Toby Ford and Cassia together, the camera will go to the direction of Kelly Ray. And I'm like, <laughs> why are you doing this, please? Guys, it was really hilarious, but quite fun to watch. All right, so guys, that's the recap of what happened at the party, at the pool party. All right, thank you so very much, guys, for watching. Please do well to like and subscribe to Substance TV for more cheese and updates on the Big Brother Ninja No Lose Guard edition. See you guys in my next video. Until then, stay splendid.